Kidney cancer in early stages typically has no signs or symptoms and we don't have a blood test for it. There's no screening test for kidney cancer. The majority of patients that are found to have a tumor in the kidney, it's actually a, a finding that occurs by accident when they get a scan, for example, a CAT scan or an MRI, or they get an ultrasound that shows it unexpectedly. Thankfully, those people that are surprised because they're feeling perfectly fine and we find something by accident are highly likely to be cured, and that's good news. For patients with very advanced disease, then uh, we do see symptoms from kidney cancer. Those can be things like loss of appetite, weight loss, even fevers, night sweats, pain in the belly, pain in the side, pain elsewhere. Blood in the urine can occur in patients with relatively advanced kidney cancer. There's a long list of things that can give us a tip off that something is not right in terms of what the patients might perceive. And then there's things that doctors might see that are nonspecific on laboratory tests. For example, low blood counts can be a sign of a kidney cancer. I think it's important for people to understand that a lot of that stuff can occur from something completely benign, not related to kidney cancer. So if you have a weird ache or a pain, if your doctor sees something abnormal, it's not something we have to get really concerned about. It could be nothing, but it's something we definitely wanna check into. And if we do find a kidney tumor, then the faster, again, we get to take care of you, the better we can make the situation.